What's going on? My name is Jay and in this quick video I want to show you how you can run a very simple A-B test for your WordPress pages and today I'm going to use the DV Builder. You can see here the concept is very simple like you have a page and then you have another page and this one have a different title and maybe the color of the button is different or you can change whatever you want here then you put you put those those pages in test and you can see here that we have a winner because this one have more clicks and now you can actually go with this one and keep that one but you never know which one will do better if you don't test them all right so we're gonna do that very quickly so i'm gonna go here to my wordpress dashboard um, i'm gonna go to my pages I have here a home page. I'm going to click edit. All right. And here you can see that I'm using the Divi Builder. Uh, you can click on the description. I have a tutorial using Divi Builder. It's very cool. I really like it a lot. And it's very easy to use. You can see here I have an image. I have a text and I have a button. All right. Let's preview this page and let's see how it looks. Okay. Now you can see here I have this image of this book. You can scroll down, you will see here a little bit of information and then a button. All right, here's the deal. Maybe you want to use another picture that is, this is, this one is huge. So I don't know, I kind of don't like it, but I like it at the same time. I don't know if, if people are going to like it because it's huge. So I don't know. The way to know is by running an A-B test so I can test both pages one with this one and one with a th smaller photo and then you can choose which one you want to use after the test is done because if I don't have too many clicks in this one then I know something is wrong and maybe it's that photo all right so let's go I'm gonna click here on edit the page okay back to the DV builder here I'm going to click here in this uh, three lines button or burger menu. And here we have some options. We have some CSS and some colors and stuff like that. But we have something here called enable split testing. All right. So I'm going to click here and you will see now a couple new options like the bounce rate limit, stat refresh shortcode tracking and that's it that's that those are the new things now we have here the custom css and stuff like that all right so the bounce rate is when someone goes in your website and gets out of your website very quickly so right now this is five seconds let's say someone goes and in less than five seconds close my website it it's going to count as a bounce rate because it's kind of someone that is going in and out very quickly you can change this let's say that you want to change it to 20 seconds because someone uh, goes and in less than in less than 20 seconds it is going to count as a bounce rate that's you know you can choose all right and uh, this is a stat so all the details like clicks and bounce rate and stuff like that the refresh can be every hour or every day Okay, and then shortcode tracking. This is a little bit more complex, but it's something, it's a shortcode that you can add in a different page. Let's say that you are selling something and you have a thank you page. After the client just bought that item, um, you can know if that was done using this shortcode. So if you're a little bit confused about this, don't worry. I'm going to put a link in the description so you can read about this shortcode uh, for tracking. Okay. All right, so everything is done. I have this yes. Let's get this down to five seconds, which is the you know, normal. I'm gonna click save. And now it's gonna tell me, all right, uh, the DV leads is split testing is activated. Um, now you can create a different element variations. Okay, let's proceed. Now you need to choose which one you want to test. And right now I want to test my image. So I'm gonna click here. And it says, you know, congratulations, you have now selected your split test, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I'm going to click there. And now you need to choose your goal. 
which is my button. I want to know how many clicks I am going to get depending on the image, right? So I'm going to click here on the button and that's it. Congratulations. Now your, your, your split test is ready to go and we're going to notice. Okay. All right. Now you're going to, you're going to see that you have uh, two images and you can use a lot more you just need to clone here so you if you click and click you can see this number one two three four you can have i don't know a thousand if you want to but for now i just want two all right i'm have that i have that huge image and then i'm going to change this one to a smaller one so i'm going to click here i have this one so i'm going to upload a new image and here I have this, you know, a wider image. May a little, I just cropped that image. So I'm gonna click save. And here you can see now the difference between both. Now I'm gonna click save. Now I have both and I can right click and I can click preview. All right, now you can scroll and you can actually see both images so you can see the difference between both and then you can actually see you know the text and our button all right so this are two different variations now which is perfect it's all i want so i'm gonna i'm just can i just can close this but i'm gonna change the name so i can know uh which one is you know like let's say this one is the wide and this one is the big image. That's the big one. All right, so we have the big one and we have the white one. All right, and our goal is our button. Now we are ready to test. So I'm just gonna click update or publish, publish if it's a new page. I'm gonna click update. All right, and that's it. Our test is ready and running now after maybe one day i don't know some month of the time i give this test like one week and then i go here you can see this uh, uh you can see split testing stats and there is a little icon with an animation you can click there and here you will see everything like how many clicks how many bounce rate everything will be here and you can decide which one is get, is doing better right now there's nothing because this is new so this is going to be loading here forever because i don't have uh any information right now but you're going to see something like this which you know there's a lot of details that you can actually maybe uh, send to your client and say hey look this page is doing a lot better let's remove this one etc etc right now after you're done and everything is cool and this let's say that this one is doing a lot better i'm gonna click here again and i'm gonna disable the split the split test split testing <laughs> sorry and click save now you need to choose the winner right okay yes now you need to choose which one is the winner so right now mine is is i don't know let's say this one is the winner the the smaller image i'm gonna click there and that's it we are back to normal um the other one was removed and now i can click update and that's it Subscribe if you want to keep learning and click on the bell icon to receive notifications every time I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching. Have a beautiful day. Bye bye.